Hello again, this is Minky on my craft. This is your host, Hilda. Um, how you doing today? Uh, we have a rainy, cloudy day and it's going to get cold. Um, I have two unboxing. Actually, I have four, but we're going to do it in two videos. The first two are going to be a squares. Um, two unboxings from Diamond Art Club. Yeah, this is one of my favorite, well, this is number one favorite in me uh, buying uh, diamond painting kits because of the quality of the canvas, the quality of the drills, and the definitions, uh, the details uh, on their canvas, on their picture. They is now pixelating. No, that I have seen. So as you can see, I already received them. I'm going to show you the process how I... Uh, I store the drills and do the inventory. I'm going to show you a picture. <laughs> I'm about to reach the ceiling. <laughs> and I have these two plus seven more right here in my living room. <coughs> so let's get started. I already took the plastic cover out, took it out of the box so we can speed it up a little bit because we want to see where we can put some sparkles on it. Um, these are the most recent release uh christmas see uh diamond art uh diamond paintings so let's get start with one first put the other one over here so the box that diamond art club has uh they're kind of has a holographic to it I don't know if you can see it. It has the instructions. Let me put it this way. It will be better. It has the instructions what the kit contains in three languages. It has um, instructions on how diamond painting. It has some warnings. And it has a QR code over here where you can scan and get a 10% off. And the first one we're going to do is Christmas morning. This is 105 centimeter by 70 centimeters, which is 41.3 inches by 27.6 inches. So this is a pretty big one. This is a square uh, drill. Drill comes in two sizes either round or square. Square are smaller, they're actually 2.5 millimeters. Rounds are 2.8 millimeters. Uh, they're bigger. So, but squares are used for a lot of uh, paints that, have con that are heavy in terms of items in the paint. Uh, so you want to give them definition. You don't want them to be pixelated. So the ones, the box tells you what type of drill we'll have. This one is a square, it's blue. And something that I noticed, and you're going to see it on the second video, is the top of the box, the color, the predominant color matches uh, the color of the type of drill, which is in this case blue, uh, which is marked by the square diamond. Okay? So we're going to open the box. The box is not going to be thrown away because I already marked the day that it was received. We got the canvas. We got the kit. We got these a small um, sticker that is useful to put it in a book. I'm collecting them. Um, just in case I have to mail one. So I'm putting on this side over here. What else we got in here? And we got the sticker. This one has 63 freaking colors. <laughs> Not even a case of 60 is going to be enough. So here are the, the key codes. They're symbol, letters, and numbers, but they're very, you can see them very well. 
let me see I'm sorry this is not the guy on the background is kind of oh, I'm awake that's my baby and here is a picture of it I hope I'm doing it okay um we can put it this way you can see it of the Santas this sticker I'm gonna show you what I do with this sticker let me run to my printer that is on my side and then I um because I print this I make a copy of this so hold on just a second okay sorry to make you wait so when i get this i make a copy of it because i'm going to store this with this and the drills on a separate bin so over here i put the receive day which is 10 15 20 because i'm doing it from the earliest one on you know and then i started and complete it okay so let's put that aside we have 65 63 colors and let me see how many ABs it got two ABs 125 and 133 but I think we can pump this one up let me though before that we go i'm going to show you the kit their kits are pretty complete there is a difference you get a pen used to have a placer oh here they are here it is here is a three placer or three or four let me see they used to have them this is a four placer a four places they are oh this one got a lot of baggies on it i'm gonna put them aside because i use this baggie for the smaller kits it has a cushy so you can put it in the pen it has two heart shaped waxes it has a clear boat boat with a spout and it has a tweezers. Uh, they give you tweezers when the kit is a square. Okay, when the kit is round, you got everything else in here, but you don't get the tweezers. You get the tweezers only on the squares. And I use the tweezers to do the checkboard on the squares. On the rounds, I use the, the pen that I'm using. Okay. So now let's get to see this baby. This huge baby. Probably going to have to show you in parts. Because I don't think. Let me see. Yep. This is as high as it goes.
Oh boy. <laughs> this is huge. And there is two packs of drills. We're gonna look at this drill, but we're gonna look at it from the inside of the packs. Cause this one, I really cannot put them back together. <laughs> You get a step-by-step -step instruction and it has a coupon over here, right? A coupon code and you have all the instructions on how to diamond paint. Plus it gives you some tips and tricks, okay? So here it is. The canvas is what is called turpaline and it's very soft. It's like you can cover yourself in winter with it because it's soft. And look at that key coat. Let's see how bad it is. Look at that key coat, how big it is. Here it goes, one on the floor. Okay. And this is huge. Christmas Morning by the McNeil Studio. Take a look at this. I'm gonna have to do it this way because there's no way we can use it. But let's do something first. It has the word Christmas over here and it's pretty well defined right here. It has the letter of Christmas and they are pretty well defined. So that's not going to be a problem. This is something that I will put a sparklers on it to make it shine. And uh, some ABs on the toys. Here's a teddy bear. Here are very well defined gifts that you see. I will put all ABs also here on the window on the snow because you know sometimes when you go out and it's the snow the snow is kind of shiny so I'm gonna put some ABs over here but I'm not gonna fill it out with ABs though. I probably accent the tree with some ABs uh, on the Christmas ornaments over here. I will accent the, the Christmas ornaments with ABs. Probably I do this one in Sparkles, original one. And this is Santa. The Santa, I think I'll put some ABs some around here on the white areas. And um, here's Santa putting the gifts under the tree. This gift probably I will accent a little bit with the ABs. These are all the lamps that are shiny. If you look at the original picture, they're shiny. So I will put some sparkles there. Definitely, I will put some sparkles over here on the fireplace and some ABs just to enhance. And here in the holy, I probably do also ABs on the ribbon and on the holy and then the sparkles over here. The sparkles over here some ABs over here, although probably they are already, no, it's not. Because 125 is the diagonal and I hardly don't see them. Let's see, I'm trying to find The 125, 133 are these ones. It's gonna be right here. It's, it's, um, it's kind of, it look, the car looks like the 720. Yeah, it doesn't have a 720 over here. But these um, AB look like 720. 
and it's going around there. There is no ABs on the fireplace. So there is some 133 over here, the orangey one, dark orange. We're going back up again, just in case you haven't seen it. Honestly, I don't even see where it's a diagonal. I don't see them. Probably when we start making it, because I want to do this one. This reminds me of better times. Oh, here it is. Here is some of the 125 that are going to go through that. Uh, one of the ADs. Here is where it goes. And here over here. But I would like to enhance the window too. I believe the AV should have been done in the windows, but you know, each designer on his own. But, um, oh, this is a beautiful one. To be able to do it like this, to see it, not completely. Nope. My, uh, Oh, this is so beautiful and so detailed. You see, this is why it has to be a square. You cannot put it around on, on, a, on a detailed um, canvas like this one. Even the socks are very detailed, you know. Oh, the mittens, I don't know how you call it. The Christmas stockings, that's the name of it. Even the Christmas stockings are detailed. The fireplace is very detailed with the rocks or the wood, the iron bars, whatever, and the fire and the sparklers on the fire. Used to have some uh, ornaments over here. There's some gifts in here. That's probably the rug of the place. Here are some more details. Even his boots have some detail. This one is going to come out gorgeous one. This is going to be beautiful. Tremendous. And like I said, you cannot do this in square. First of all, I mean in round. First of all, the round is a bigger drill. 2.8. 0.3 millimeters bigger. Which in the world of jewelry and probably the world of diamond painting it seems like it's a big deal. And um, this has a lot of detail that would get lost if this were done in round. So even the gift has the detail of the bow on the gift. It looked like what a loaf of bread or some cookies or whatever he got there. I cannot see it well. Probably let me see. Let me check in here. Oh no, that's a gift. That's a gift that is wrapped in gold paper and it has a bow on it. Even his face is very well defined. And you have these little houses, you know, and the ornaments in the chimney and the holly, uh, holly berry. Look at the tree on the back. Let's look at the tree. The tree has some even candy canes on it. And I think this is kind of a wreath on the wall, a Christmassy wreath. And you got the ornaments 
when you can which you can enhance with the ABs right let's see I'm gonna have to wrap this you see more gift all this stuff cannot be done in in round I'm sorry I know there's a lot of people that love rounds because they're easy blah blah but the thing is not every canvas can be round and not every canvas can be squared so this is a canvas that properly was up properly uh charted for a square drills i love the amount of detail i'm in love with this canvas because look at the gifts over here and you can see the bows on it and the different colors of the package this one i couldn't identify because you know the tradition of giving uh santa some cookies he's a teddy bear here is a truck or a wheel a car that has the wheel you can define the wheels you can define the steering wheel here are the seats i mean uh and here is more gift here is a pillow with a snowflake which you can also put some sparkle on it oh i'm loving this let me wrap wrap it a little bit because we are about to be done anyway here is a sleigh with the reindeers and you can see the horn that's how you call it <laughs> pardon you can correct me i don't mind and here's the sleigh with the he has a wreath on it and the gift here is a c h r i s m i mean t m a s christmas very well defined the letters you know i will put those letters in uh a b's too so they can look better on it there's a few changes that i'm gonna make and that's the share and this is a wall with our curtains and here is one lamp here is another one i mean you cannot ask for a a great christmas square painting definitely i love it i love all the detail and i love that the fact that those details are not lost with the round ones because sometimes you get some detail lost in the round ones um and honestly i'm going to show you the drills but i'm going to put this first in the box you cannot do this to me this is a christmas one that i'm gonna do pretty soon i'm gonna start pretty soon i want to do all the christmas and now this thing doesn't want to get in there now now we can put it inside so we can add it up let me get the other pack i fell on the floor okay here's uh, <laughs> the 65 colors on drills <laughs> so what we're gonna do is we're gonna look for the 2ab the 125 and 133 let's start with this one but i don't i'm gonna get it out of the package but i don't think i'm gonna open it too much <laughs> like i said i wish we are taught how to put this together because honestly 
I don't know how they do it. I'm trying to look. Here's the 125. Here's one of the 80s. The 125. This one. AB stands for Aurora Borealis. And now this one got a stick on it. And that's a coating, a special chemical coating. It's a safe chemical one. This is the other one. This is 133. This is the... Let me put you a little bit more down so you can see the... This one is... Uh, it's a special coating that they gave them for them to shine. It's a safe chemical coating, by the way. Um, like I explained in another video, I tried to find out how I can do this homemade. Because, you know, I cannot find 498, neither 814 on ABs. And the problem is that many of these canvas 498 and 814 are coming together just like 321 and 666 they come together because there are different shades and they're trying to change you know they're trying to make like a gradient uh type of change in in the canvas and i cannot do it because uh we don't have the 80s to enhance those changes so, but it's a forbidden homemade procedure. You know, unless somebody comes up with a better idea, which I hope so. Um, some days, and now this thing got screwed, and that's what I don't like to take it out, out of the package. So this one got curved. Here it is. Let's see. So here is a pack of colors. A lot of reds. A lot of wintry colors like the like the blues and the white. Let's see if I can put this back. Go to the second pack. Do you see the difference? <laughs> How uh, skinny one. So we have the two ABs over here, 125 and 133. Over here there is no AB, so I'm not gonna open this too much. This one still has a lot of greens for the tree. Yes, you can see the greens, the reds, beautiful. And by the way, the package has the DMC code. So once I I show you before that I make a copy of the of the stickers, right? And then I write this information. Once I do that, since this one has two I have this bag of Yeah, I'm gonna put this one. I'm gonna try to put this rubber band. Then I include the sticker over here because I'm going to use this for my container. I 
I'm going to try to put them together side by side. If not, no, nope. it's not working that way. So I'm going to have to put one in top of the other. I don't like to put the drills with the canvas because I like to check my list and uh, that worked better. And um, um, and I just grab the, 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 the drills and then keep them up instead of, uh, you know, going back and forth. So here's the other one. Let me put you up. See, so you can see. Again, it's a square, right? With the instructions. And this one is 98 centimeter by 70 centimeter, 38.6 inches by 27.6 inches. So it's another big one. Here is the little sticker for your book. Here's the big sticker that I'm going to make a copy of it. But I'll take care of that later. And here's a toolkit that I showed you before that contains a tweezer because this is also a square. Plus the back tells you what type of kit it is, but I'm taking the bags out because I have the baggy in a Ziploc bag because I use them for, you know, the snack size. I don't, I don't go much on a... Uh, I'm kidding up these snack size. So here it is. This one, whoa, 65. <laughs> I am mean, a what? Masochist or whatever you want to call it for big ones. Look at this. Oh, that Christmas tree is driving me crazy. And the, the little dog in the middle, too. Excuse me just a moment. Let me drink a little bit of my Diet Coke. So now let's get this puppy up. Out. Oops. Five colors, and I thought that 54 was bad. Let's see. Let's do the same thing as the other one. Here's again your step by step instructions. Here are two pack, one bigger than the other one, of uh, the drills. We'll take care of that. This one is a smaller, but just by a little bit. So I'm going to do this again. Let me show you, right? Let me get this stuff out of here. Okay, so let's do this by part. It has how many ABs? Oh, this one has three ABs. 128, 130, and 141. And it's one, two, three. Here is a two. It's kind of a yellow one in the garland. You're going to find them. 
in the East Garden. I'm sorry. <laughs> You're gonna find the twos on it. Here is a chair, a nice kind of antique or Victorian style chair. And here's a clock. I will give some enhancement to the clock. You know, put some copper sparkles on it. And the share too. Oh, the share will be like a red. Let me see. Yep, they got the 321. And the 666, I got both for square. The sparkle for squares are round, but they are the same side as the square, 2.5. So they can fit in the drill field. Okay. Here is the Afghan. This is another one who needed to be in a square because of the detail. It all depends on the amount of details. And this type of detail is what makes the paint look real good. Real, you know. Let's see. This is a pillow over here. And the pillow looks like it has some uh, paper prints. No, some green and flower prints. That's what he has. I have to double check. These are two flower mirrors. I mean, two flower um, paints or whatever. You got that. You got uh, a base and like a, a cup over here. Here are some details of the rug. And uh, yeah, you got some details over here of the rugs. And I can see that you have like a kitten over here. And another one over here. Another doggy. Here's this nice doggy. And there's some uh, toys. Here are the Christmas stockings and this one has number three on it so this one has uh ABs on it also in these garlands there is number two and the fire has number twos on it although I would like that better than sparkles so I don't know I have to think about that I love this mantle I mean, it has some Christmas decoration. Here is what it looks like a, a nut Santa and a nutcracker or elf. Here's uh, um, oh, how you say a light with two candles. Here is a big ornament. And more stockings with more. Uh, I'm trying to show you as much as I can. I know that the, that's a good thing about this light. You can change it the way you want it. Here's another cat. These two are looking toward the fire at, uh, place. Here's a, a picture of a church. A very well defined with the skies and the tree. It has some ABs, number two over here, number three, number three, even at the steeple of the church. You have some ornaments over here that can be highlighted a little bit. Oh, I love this fireplace. No wonder the name of this one is Festive Fireplace. Yeah, it's very festive, all right. I will put some ABs over here. I think that the L... Yeah, the L is triple six, so... 
they have some ABs here, number three and number two. I don't see any number one. Number one is 128. I'm looking for it to see if I can find it. The number one. Maybe some other place. Let's keep on looking. Here it is. We're getting we're getting there to the Christmas tree. Here we have some more three trees over here. There's another lamp, candles, the garland, the mantle. I love the mantle. This is a clock. Here is the doggy, the two cats looking at the tree. Here are the kiss Christmas tree. I mean the Christmas gifts. Here's another kitten over here. I don't see the number one around here either. All I have seen is the two and the threes. And the two and the threes are in the, in the Christmas tree. Here are some more gifts. There is a nutcracker over here. I'm looking for that number one. I don't see to find it. You see, this is where I have to get these two. Although my husband is into a position that, hmm? <laughs> where are you going to put us some of those gets into the ceiling? Uh, I say, I don't know. Maybe I'll find some other place that goes all the way up to the ceiling. I have to drink a lot of liquid. I don't see that number one. Gee. Maybe I missed it right up on my nose. But the garland has a lot of number twos. Let me see if it's in here. And no, it's not even on the top of the Christmas. Three. On the top, the Christmas tree topper. That's what I should say. Oh God, I love the amount of detail of this. It's just so wonderful. Look at that garland. How big it is. And the Christmas ornaments. And there is no one on the Christmas garland, though. I don't see them. I don't see the, that one. 128. I look like it's like a pinkish one. This is another one that marries the square drills. You cannot definitely put a run on this. You're going to have, if you put this on round, this is going to be so pixelated that it's going to look awful because you got so much detail that you need to show in order to, you know, the paint to come alive. That's how I see it. That's what I do with either one of them, round or square, depending on, um... As a matter of fact, most of my snack size are around. And, uh, but these merits, uh, a square drills. This is so gorgeous. It's not the same as having it in person. Even when I uh, zoom in and DAC shows on Facebook, uh, the two, the original and the, the rendition in the drill, 
with a square around uh, it uh, it doesn't make justice so when you see it in person so you can see the amount of details that you see you got to get one of this I mean the AC I'm making my own collection I know I cannot buy every week but and I'm planning to make a maze one of chalk pins and uh, the great treasures outdoor I believe is the name of it so I hope to get it but I like to oh here is the ones the ones are right here in the sky right here Oh, and did I tell you guys the drill fill is clear as a sunshine day. Um, I don't have a problem with the with the drill fills. I'm not gonna. And like I said, this the canvas is a purpling, and for what I understand, it makes the colors to pop up more that's probably it looks so great and then when you put those drills down <laughs> oh my god here the whole mantle is on threes i like that they enhance that part so this is it this is a grandfather clock One more pass. Look at this gorgeous thing. Don't you want one of this? Oh. And then when you buy one, you get this uh, code inside and also on the slip package, you have another code in there. You better be in the lookout. It's only small letters. So, and look at that tree, that gorgeous tree, tree, Christmas tree. 65 colors, folks, which is worth it because uh, you, you got a lot of details. I'm sorry. Uh, I do either round or square. I'm not a fan of either one, except in cases like this, details gotta have the square one details gotta have the square ones okay so let's look at the drills let's see if we can find the let me put you down let's see if we can find god this thing is a little violent on me <laughs> Okay. I hope they have the. I'm looking for the ABs over here. Look at all these colors. Oh, and they don't. And look at all these drills. And they don't have dimples on it. It's a lot of gray because of the background of the house. Here's the first one, the yellowy one, the one that goes through the garland. Those are the ABs, the Aurora Borealis. Like I say, it's a special coating that they give to the drills. So, so far over here, we have one of the AB drills, 130. The rest of the colors are more like at the background, the rug, and... Here's one. Here's the other one. 
They should be the other two should be here. I'm looking for them. Here is one forty one. And then there is the other one. Um 128 we're looking for which kind of a pinkish light pink look at that purple look at these two colors together some more reds for the tree I missed it on the other one. I'm looking for the ABs to show you. Oh, here it is. 128. The ones that goes in the sky in the paint over the mantle where the church is. Look at this. So are your colors 65 color what in the world I was thinking but I don't mind it's a gorgeous thing just like the other one wait until I show you in the next one the next two Christmassy ones are round and I'm gonna show you the difference and one of them, I think it should have been done in a square, but because of the amount of detail. So, so this is for the first part of the Christmas uh, DAC ones um, so far um, that I have. And, and to remind you to thank you for watching, subscribe and hit the notification bell. Besides diamond painting, we're going to have some, we having some other craft on the channel. Right now we are in the cycle with the houses. The only craft that is going to change is the other one. Diamond painting is going to stay forever. But um, the other two crafts are going to be interchangeable. Uh, although I have another one coming but that i won't talk about it until next year um, is also related to paper so this is it thank you for watching remember subscribe and the notification bell hope you have a wonderful day until then love and peace and remember to vote to make your voice heard